Oh boy, I have some exciting news. Uh, a few of you have been encouraging me for quite some time to make a Patreon, and I finally did, and uh, I've got two Patreon supporters before even the announcement of the Patreon, which is this, and I won't mention it, uh, except for the orange bell, of course. So this, this bell is for Travis Reeves. Uh, he's actually one of the lead guitar players for And The Leavers, so no big surprise. I sent it to him to see what, I, what he thought about what I wrote, but this bell is for Michelle. Whoever you are, wherever you are, Michelle, thank you so much for uh, heading on over there in the convoluted, you know, set of ways you would have had to, to go to find me <laughs> on there. So thank you, and I'll put the link to my Patreon in the description. You can go see what that's all about. Uh, okay, today we are doing Shadow on the Sun. I'm being pulled into a, another rabbit hole like the Jesus one. This is the Shadow one. Uh, for Chris Marl, Renato Gomez, Josh Sefton, and Bill Gattis. Audio slave, of course, but once you've got your guitar into drop B, <laughs> I've got a video on that. Go, uh, go, go do that, but the gist of it is really low B. It's going to be super rattly. I apologize uh, in advance for my intonation. We're not all Tom Morello. We don't have a special guitar dedicated to drop D. B, rather. F sharp. B, E, G sharp, and C sharp. It's the same as drop D. It's just three half steps down. Now, once you've got that done, you can play the song. All right, everybody present. Here we go. D string 12th fret. G string 10th fret. You're going to recognize that as a root and a minor third, because the only other thing we're gonna do for the verse is D string 10th fret and G string 9th fret. You'll recognize that is a root and a major third, right? So we've got, well, we're in drop B, um, so it's not really a D, but we can still call it a D minor, D root minor third, because we're all guitar players here, no piano players in the room, so we know what we mean. Back and forth like that, then move down to 10, 9. chorus, the pickup notes going into the chorus are, you're going to feel really special doing this because of how far you're going to reach, open, drop D style power chords, right? All the same fret in the, well, E, A, and D strings. You're going to go open 7th, 3, before the chorus starts, right? And then it's 5, 3, 12. Subsequent choruses are longer, right? So instead of the last one, when you go 5, 3, 10, instead of 10, it's 5, 3, open 5, 7, 5, followed by the fill, 3, 5, 3, open. So, I'll do, I'll just do it in context. Whole first chorus. solo. Of course, it's a Tom Morello solo, so there's three guitars going at once with pedals that nobody has, but uh, let's see how many, how many gists we can get so that you can do something along these gists. Ready? The first part, anyway, is really straightforward. B15, 15, 15, 13, 
E13, back to Bertin, and then the harmonizing two guitars, but you can do both of the notes up until we run out of frets here because, you know, maybe he's got two whole octaves on his uh, guitar, which I don't, but I'll give you a, a different note for the very last one. So, uh, B15 and E13 at the same time, followed by both 17, then B18 and E20, and then we want uh, uh, 20, 20, 22, B22, 22, and E should be higher than 22, but probably 24, but I don't have that fret, so <laughs> both 22s. That's not a bad harmony, it's just not the very harmony that he used, so... Uh, <laughs> feel like Tom Morello. Whew. And then the crazy part crashes in and you can grab B15 and Bertin. Throw on your wah pedal, make it sound like a mess. Or your, what's that red wah pedal, the, the pitch shifting wah pedal that he has? Man, I want one of those. And I will have one of those. <laughs> In fact, the first Patreon money's going to one of those. Mess around like that. I mean, he's in the top end of the the D minor pentatonic there when he's doing that. So you you can mess around with your 13, 15, 13, 15, 14, and 12. That would you could just be in D minor pentatonic for this solo to do your own thing. And then there's that guy that gets in with this curious scale, which uh, pretty much just messing with those notes the whole time. Um, 17. 19, 20, 19, 17, 20 on B, 19. That's sort of its little uh, resolve spot there. I didn't, you know, really get a moment to look at what scale that is or anyways the possible six scales it could be given, <laughs> given it's just part of a scale. But uh, yeah, you can do stuff with those things. Oh, I've encountered this enough times now to recognize it. It's the major scale with a flat seventh, so the minor seventh uh, out of the major scale, D. So here's D major, right? But here's the flat seventh. What did that just sound like? That sounded like the man who sold the world. That's the Mixolydian scale. The Mixolydian scale has a, has a flat seventh, or the seventh from the minor scale uh, relative to the regular. He's playing the D Mixolydian scale. Which is why it sounded so neat when he landed on that F sharp. Because we assumed, sorta, that he was probably minoring it up, but then that major third in there just sounded so nice and fuzzy, okay? Oh, but the rhythm part, the bass is playing D, C, F on the eighth fret of the A string, back to C the first time. Second time, almost the same. D, fifth fret. C, third fret. And then F, eighth fret. Up to G, tenth fret. And then it goes into the, co the chorus part. If you're playing the rhythm section, which of course no guitar is, but you know, that'd be fun too. Okay, bye. I mean, not bye. Just... In the last verse, there's that little tiny note that's just 10th fret of the E string, 15th fret of the B string, either one you want. The last chorus before the outro finally gives you the satisfaction of going shadow on the sun. Big low power chord there. And the outro starts as single notes, so 12 on the, it's all in the E string, 12, 3, 5, open, 10, 12, open, 3, 5, open, 12, 3, 5, open, 10, 12, open, 3, 5, open. possible in one in one measure this is fun and then it switches to power chords same frets <laughs> And 
And then the very end is just threes and opens. <laughs> Shadow on the Sun. Thanks for the awesome request. Thank you for being here. I hope that was helpful. I hope your guitar survives. Drop a B, and I will see you next time with more stuff. Good luck and goodbye.